testing out another knife. Uh, this is a uh, Chicago Cutlery. This knife's kind of a, a clunker. And here I got our very ripe banana. I'm going to try cutting. Hardly cuts through the banana. It takes a lot of effort just to cut through the banana. So I'm just going to give it a few strokes like this. And then try the banana once more here. Oh, yep. Goes right in. Almost no effort. So I got to tell you, it's, uh, it's sharper. And of course, a banana is soft. It doesn't matter. Here's this piece of paper I was using earlier. It's uh, quite a few folds of paper here, okay? Uh, just to show you, that knife's got a nice, nice bite on it now, okay? It's pretty good. And you can spend a little more time on this uh, tool and uh, follow the instructions, give it just a little bit more, and uh, there you go. Got to edge back on this knife. It's good. Canis is made in uh, Austria, and the quality is very, very nice. A few people have asked us to review this, so I'm going to show it to you. First, uh, directions are on the back of the box. Simply sharp, just sharpen the knife by pulling it through. Uh, you can pull it through with a slight downward angle like this. Honing the knife, you pull it through with a slight upward angle. And serrated blades, you pull them through kind of at an angle. So I'll show you what's in the box here. How to use. Okay, pretty cool. And the item. There you go. Volcanus is very unique. Uh, it's an interesting spring-loaded double blade uh, system. And uh, it's really good quality. Ah. The directions are also on the bottom. I kind of like it. So just for simple use, you take the Volcanus, you hold it with one hand, and you just pull your knife through like this. Spring-loaded, very minimal pressure, almost no pressure. I got to tell you, this knife was very, very dull before I started here. So I'm just going to pull it through a few times. You can hear it grabbing the metal and cutting the metal. Removing a little bit of metal, okay? And I've got a piece of paper here, a piece of newspaper that's about 10 folds. So I gotta tell you, that knife right away is getting honed a little bit faster. So, according to the directions now, to uh, do a hone, all you do is uh, pull it through like this very gently for a quick honing. So, I'm just gonna do a few strokes here try this baby out. Uh, you can see exactly what I'm doing here. Again on this paper. Yeah, it's got a nice edge to it. This is not an expensive knife. It's definitely sharper. Okay, and I want to try the serrated blade as well. So for the serrated blade, uh, they're saying you just pull through horizontally at a slight angle. Maybe like this. Aha! Uh -huh. You can feel it and hear it hitting just the very bottom edge. Okay. Oh yeah, it removed the burr. That's a lot sharper. We'll try this. It's removing the uh, burr from the bottom edge of the blade. Anyway, pretty cool. I like this unit. The Volcanus. And it's in stock at your sponsor. ChefDepot.com. Thanks for watching and have a great day. Here's a brand new knife. This is a Geeser from Germany. Really, really nice knife. Uh, this is a fishing fillet knife, and of course, these are in stock at the site. Uh, I want to show you uh, how to hone with this. And again, the directions are right here on the bottom uh, for honing. <clears throat> Very simple. All you do is pull through from the heel to the tip very very gently just lightly lightly touching those rods very simple very very easy to use just a very very light touching okay this knife is very very sharp I've got this piece of paper here again uh, quite a few layers and I'm going to show you wow I could probably shave with this knife it's very very sharp so that gives you an idea of uh, 
what you can accomplish. Of course the knife's brand new, but that doesn't matter. It's definitely sharper now than it was a few minutes ago. Very, very nice. And this knife is uh, highly flexible as well. Very cool. In stock at your sponsor. All the items tested. ChefDepot.com Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.